What is up guys, Expert Winner here, wouldn't call me Dominic and in this video we are playing WWE 2K20 My Career Mode. Let's do this. This is what's going to give us confidence, recognition, success, everything we've ever wanted. Your Earth Science Notebook is going to do all that? No. My characters, the boy character the skin look weird. We'll accomplish someday when we become WWE superstars. We could do that. Or we could play my favorite lunchtime game, guess what Mr. Bowman's sweat stains look like today. I'm kind of seeing a heart shape. What do you think? I think you need to take this seriously. Besides, it's a proven fact that if you write down your goals, it helps you achieve them. Actually, now I'm thinking it looks more like a one-eared rabbit. Fine. I'll go first to get the ball rolling. Become WWE Divas Was champion. that the kid from WWE 2K19? Okay. Star I'm not in sure. a WWE action movie. Really? That's one of your goals? Do you want me to do the list or not? Besides, it's a proven fact. WWE action movies are some of the finest pieces of cinematic art ever produced. So it would be an honor to appear in one. Whatever. Train at the dungeon. Come up with awesome wrestling names. Team with Mickey James. Get my own action figure. Compete on NXT. Win a dance off. Wrestle Lita. Find out what's inside Undertaker's urn. Get inducted into the WWE Hall of Fame. Be in a WWE video game. Win a ladder match. I've got a match for you. My butt, your face. What are you two fartwads doing? This table is reserved for wrestling team members only. I thought there was a lot of boogers stuck underneath it. <laughs> Bunny, you can leave now. Sorry, we're busy. Get my own action figure, become WWE Divas Champion. Is this some kind of WWE nerd vision board? Hey! Being immortalized in semi-posable plastic is the greatest thing a human being can achieve. Don't ever touch our stuff again. What, like this? <sighs> that was a huge mistake. Oh, we scrapping in the cafeteria? Please tell me yes. I wanna fart in the cafeteria. Okay, I guess not. Beautiful spinning elbow. Oh, wrenching on her arm. Oh. Beautiful backflip. Brooklyn Beautiful maneuver Anyways, I would have hoped um, um What was I going to say? Oh, yeah, I would have hoped um, this match was going to be in the cafeteria as I said, but no nah, Never mind. Right, get, get Brooklyn to Red Health. Gotcha. Beautiful maneuver. Oh, elbow. Oh, reversal. Oh, reversal again. Beautiful slam. Pop. Oh, reversal. Beautiful day day too. I wish sweep into the corner. Oh, kick to the side. S belly to the side suplex by Red. I think that's a motorbike at the outside. Oh, dang it. Damn, Red is destroying Brooklyn at the moment. Yep, there goes the motorbike. Oh, complete. Uh, strike Brooklyn while standing in the ring. Oop, reversal. Oh. Oh, here's a tray. Slips over. 
Oh. Second. Oh, it goes to the top rope. Moon so beautiful on the legs. One, two, three. And that's it. Good match by um, Red. <coughs> Alright. Let's move on. Let's move on. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Let me get this straight. You remember your fight with Brooklyn when we were in high school taking place in a WWE arena with a ring sold out crowd and commentators? The guy who can't remember the safe combination is questioning my memory? No, the guy who can't remember the safe combination is questioning your sanity. Whatever. I may have taken a few liberties with my story, but that is how I choose to remember it. Well, as much as I'd love to join you in rewriting history, that day is scorched into my brain because that's how I got my nickname, Trey. This is how it really went down. Get my own action figure, become WWE Divas Champion, is this some kind of WWE nerd vision board? Hey, being immortalized in semi-posable plastic is the greatest thing a human being can achieve. Don't ever touch our stuff again. What, like this? <laughs> that was a huge mistake. Oh no, I've unleashed Hot Head Red. I'm gonna take uh, that Now marker, they're gonna scrap. Bring it to your grandmother's nursing home and cross out parts of her chart so when the nurse goes to give her turndown service, she won't know to flip her over. That's right, I'm gonna give your grandmother bed sores. What is Whoa, wrong? Red. Calm down, deep breaths, maybe we can talk this out. I'm done talking. <laughs> <laughs> This is what happens when you mess with the captain of the wrestling team. What are you gonna do? Hit me with a steel chair? Put me through a table? Huh. I'm going to get help. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone already knows Hothead Red, but let me introduce you to her best friend, Trey. Get it? Because he busted his butt on a lunch tray. <laughs> How do you wreck your own joke? So there's no teachers around to break this up or anything? What is this high school? That could have been way worse. Yeah. Brooklyn could have posted a video of the whole thing online. Oh wait, that's she exactly did. what she did. I meant she could have dumped something worse on me, like mayo or hot sauce. And hey, at least she didn't destroy our list. So what? I'm not gonna do any of those things anyway. What do you mean? We were just embarrassed in front of the entire school, and currently, 672 people on the internet. I bet a bunch of those are repeat views. Great! We're not even touching on the fact that I got beat up by a lunch tray. I'm never going to be a WWE superstar. I'll just go to college and get a lame job like my parents want me to. <sighs> I think you need to read the letter again. This See? This is what I'm talking about. I can't even open my locker. What's your combination? 16339, I think. Letter, please. Here we go. I think this section is relevant right now. You've probably asked yourself a million times, why? Why didn't they want to be my parents? The truth is, we did, but we had to make the hardest decision of our lives because we didn't feel we could give you the life you deserved. And that life is one where you can have the freedom to follow your dreams no matter what they might be, to become anything you want. Using the only letter I have from my real parents as some sort of motivational speech is kind of a cheap move. They're right, though. You got a second chance in life, and you need to make the most of it. So why sell yourself short? You need to at least try. Fine. But when this whole WWE thing doesn't work out, I'm blaming you. It'll work out. I promise. Assuming you never have to wrestle a lunch tray. They're actually a lot tougher than they look. Huh. Yo, well, look at that bag. <laughs> oh, well, that looks like the end of this episode. Thank you guys for watching this video. Uh, 
if you want to see some more WWE 2K20 my career mode let me know down below so yeah thank you guys for watching leave a like and subscribe for more peace